It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new fight for the combatants in Reading Brick Show's Brick Rumble. Hello and welcome to the show. It's Sunday Session 1, Episode 4 of the series, and we are looking forward to more fights ahead of next episode, where there will be a one-on-one -on -one tournament bracket. Before all that, though, more whiteboard fights for you. We've got plenty in store, so without further ado, let's get started with fight number one. And it's a good one, as the awesome flippability of Pegasus takes on the spinning cyclone of Second Revolution. Pegasus we've seen do very well so far in the competition. Plenty of out of the arena flips in what we're now deeming Pegasus Corner. Will he pick another one for Sunday? Meanwhile, Second Revolution has struggled a little bit throughout this weekend, but hopefully they will be back to some form today. Let's find out as we join both down in the arena. It's over and out for Second Revolution, well done to Pegasus. Next we have a match between Bansaw and Bricker Brother. A vertical spinner versus a flipper, this time Bansaw back having destroyed Shatterstar utterly in their last fight. How will they cope against Bricker Brother who's designed to fight off those big spinners very well armoured, but their weapon reliability is a little bit suspect. Let's join them down in the arena and see how this goes. <laughs> Massively destructive battle there, but Bansaw high centred Bricker Brother, the winners. And now we have a rumble on our hands between Kato Numoidie, Jitterbug, and Slow Burn. Slow Burn had to be completely rebuilt after falling in the pit. It completely smashed to pieces. Jitterbug back in the arena with their unique drive system. They are a shuffler bot, and they'll be going up against Kato Numoidie, the Lego version of the Spinner Proof podcast Beetle Wait. Hello there. Let's join them and see how this all turns out.
face plant. <laughs> Jitterbug pitted, slow burn immobile, the wind goes to Kato Numoidio. And now we have a fight between two rookie drivers with the return of Block Lobster and The Wrecker. The Wrecker we saw in episode one, built and brought along to the event by a first time builder. How well will they get on against Block Lobster, driven by a rookie in themselves and coached by one of the other Roboteers? This should be interesting. Communication is key. Let's head down and see. Both forwards, there we go. Okay, guys, I think um, unfortunately the teachers are mobilized. The Wrecker Immobile Block Lobster is your winner. And now we have a fight between two of the most fragile armored bots in the competition, Growler and Rusty. Not quite up to the Deator standards we've seen previously, but these two both love to shed parts. Growler we've seen do reasonably well with its biting jaws. Rusty had a win under its belt after episode three. That hammer saw off Second Revolution. Mm. Excellent work. The winner, Growler. You heard it there. The winner, Growler. 
Next up, Chompy Evo will be taking on Dr. Smash. Dr. Smash have struggled with their reception all this weekend, getting his signal into the robots just wasn't working for them. Chompy Evo, meanwhile, has struggled to get that weapon going. Will we see one of these two finally working the way they should be? Let's hope so, as we join them down in the arena. Fingers crossed. <laughs> I think technically that was a vibration of the blade hitting the thing that activated it. Because Jevin had actually opened it a bit. So well done, that was a default win. A peculiar set of circumstances perfectly explained by the commentator. Thank you very much. Now we move on to a rumble between Low Blow, Broken in Transit and Santa Delivery. We've seen all three of these fighting before, we've seen the issues that some of them have and the strengths of some of them as well. Broken in Transit, a very sturdy build but does have those exposed wheels, could be susceptible to low blow spinner and Santa Delivery likes to grapple this side of the arena. This one will be very interesting, most notably because Broken in Transit's driver is going to be fighting his children. <laughs> Okay guys, um, please don't clap too much, that is his own son he's just destroyed. Okay. Absolute bullying. The winner broken in transit. And now our final fight of the episode. And it's a bit of a grudge match between Duck and Second Revolution. We'll discuss the grudge shortly, but first let's break down the robots. Duck with the 360 degree lifter, it can lift that beak the whole way round. It's very well armoured, but and it does have some signal issues when it's flipped over. Second Revolution, meanwhile, the spinner with a powerful weapon but those exposed wheels, we've seen it struggle all weekend and they've now got their toughest battle on their hands. Let me take you back to Reading Brick Show's Brick Rumble 2020, where Second Revolution and Duck fought last. It was a tough match, Duck's front face and bill all got ripped off, but then Second Revolution lost a wheel. From then on, it was all Duck pushing them into the hazards, the flame pit followed by the pit of oblivion. Will history repeat itself? Thank <laughs> you. 
Second revolution, dead in the water, a sitting duck, if you will. Duck, the winner of the battle. We hope to see it again, and we hope to see you again, because we've seen some amazing action tonight. We've seen flips, we've seen spin, we've seen plenty of axe hits and plenty of wins. From rookies to veterans and even a grudge match, the rhymes might have stopped, but the action does not. We hope to see you again when we do Reading Brick Show's Brick Rumble 2022 Sunday Session 2 the tournament bracket we look forward to seeing you there until then we hope you enjoyed this video if you did give it a like do subscribe to the channel and we shall see you next time bye bye